long time, over 20 years ago now, I traveled in on these tracks into Dubuque's. And when I stumbled across this tunnel one lonely cold night, I set up camp just for the night, you know, just to regain myself. And as I fell asleep next to my little campfire, after eating some very tasty soup, I awoke to a sound so extreme I thought I was having a heart attack. I thought I was dying. The sound went straight through my soul as I awoke. I stood up, I could see her. I couldn't see her. I, I could feel her. But I couldn't see her. I could feel her even though she wasn't anywhere near me. It felt like she was right next to me. I walked out of the tunnel searching all around. I couldn't see anything. And then I looked up. There she stood at the top of the tunnel's roof. She screamed again so loud I fell to my knees, covering my ears to protect them from the exploding sound. Then I looked up and she stopped. She looked behind her in fright and then was thrown off the tunnel. Just before she hit the ground, it got real cold and I passed out. I woke the next morning. I thought it was a dream. Because I was so shooken up, I decided to stay another night to regain myself, thinking that that was just all a bad dream. I fell asleep, and it happened again, exactly the same this time. When she had fallen to the ground, she stopped and looked at me, and then she spoke, telling me her story. Because of what she said, I have not been allowed to leave this tunnel since. She allows me to hunt. She allows me to go down to the river and bathe myself. But the second I try to leave, it's cold. It's dark. And I pass out. Always awake inside the tunnel. So I just stop trying to leave after a while. Because if she isn't happy, she has the power to unleash all the spirits and ghosts and demons that have perished in this crevice before the tunnel. And for that reason, to protect the town around me, I have stopped trying to leave. I make sure she stays content where she is, never telling me how she can cross over or what needs done. I fear that there are secrets beyond my knowledge.